What's up guys? Welcome to Lil's Pressure Washing. Today, um, we're gonna be doing a bid on this football stadium. And then after we leave here, we gotta do a bid on a children's museum and then a bid on a house. And then when we're done with that, we're gonna start, we got three houses to wash today and some gas stations to do. So we got a very busy day. Um, so without further ado guys, if it's your first time and you like this video, make sure to hit the like button and please subscribe. We'd love to have you over here. We're an amazing uh, team. We help each other out, positivity, and we're growing. So without further ado, let's get this bit started. All right, handrails right here. These handrails, and they're on behind me, the home side, the visitor side, and all throughout the stadium. Uh, we're gonna be knocking a lot of this loose blue off. They're gonna come behind me and uh, do this, the, the sanding that's required. I, I, I did set the expectations that we're not gonna be able to get this completely off, you know, like sanded down, but uh, they just wanna, uh, basically the loose stuff knocked off so they can paint. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go give an estimate. We're gonna look at both sides of the stadium uh, and coming in. So there's a lot of work to do and this has to be done by August, so there's plenty of time to do it. So let's take a look at what we got to do and get a quote together and then get to the next one. Let's go. So when the coach called me this morning, they said they wanted to knock as much of this off. They said, we know, understand it's not gonna be sandblasted and down to the bottom, but just get as much as you can so we can come and sand it and paint it uh, then once we're done. So we're gonna look at all these rails and uh, basically both sides of the football stadium um, we're going to actually try to upsell too, like where the concession stand is and any of this around here. We could probably upsell this concrete right here, but this is a lot of rails to do. If you can see right here, basically these rails go all the way around the stadium and both sides of the bleachers. You can see right here, the bleachers. So we're going to be pressure washing all of this right here. See, it comes off, but we're just going to hit it with a, they want us to hit it with a nozzle, like a turbo nozzle. So actually it's going to, it's going to be a, quite a bit of work. So the booster club wants this done before the season starts, which we can handle. You know, we do a lot. We may, we specialize in commercial work. We got three big hot water trailers that are ready to roll and uh, building the fourth. So yeah, we are ready to rock and roll. So yeah, we're going to do all this. And uh, actually, you know what? These bleachers. I'm going to upsell them too because these things need to be washed, man. Look at that. Look how dirty that is. So they want all the handrails done. They said the people are complaining about rubbing their hands on these, which I can understand. It could like cut your hand, you know, because paint. We're coming, we're going to put a turbo twist nozzle on here and blast off as much as this as possible. And then we'll come back. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put a quote together for the handrails and look. It's both sides. We got to do that side over there. All this up in here, you see this right here? That'll come off. We're just gonna, it's gonna be time consuming though. It's gonna take a lot of time, but we're gonna go ahead and throw in these bleachers as well. We're gonna put that in a bed, see if they wanna do that. Might as well clean it all. We're gonna get some measurements now. We're gonna go all the way down from one side to the other. And also up top, see? We're gonna hit up top too. That needs to be painted as well. I'm sure they want that done. And most of this right here, these steps, that, that's like algae. We can get that done, no problem. And uh, that's organics up there on those bleachers. I can guarantee they've never been washed. Looks like up top, the building's not bad at all. So, all right, this is the visitor side of the stadium. As you can see, all these rails need to be washed. So we're gonna, this is the visitor side. Like I said, we're gonna come up here and measure all this, all this down in here and over there, see? So we're gonna do the whole entire stadium. Everything that's blue, we're gonna, we're gonna try to knock that paint off and we're gonna wash the steps. Well, I'm gonna add that as an upsell because I'm sure they wanna wash them, that's nasty. So we're gonna wash all these bleachers on the visitor side. There's a couple buildings right there and we're gonna wash that entire stadium, both sides. Mm -hmm. 
once again, look at those handrails and how bad these bleachers are. We're gonna soft wash these bleachers and knock them paint off the hand, the rails up top and the bottom. We're gonna wash around the bathrooms too. As you can see, look, right here. We're gonna put this in as part of the package right here, sidewalks and the building. Do it soft wash, it'll knock a lot of that paint off. What we're gonna do is also put in concrete wash. We can get all this black up right here along the sides here right here as well and get those bugs removed up there like that wash all that right there this is the locker room i'm assuming man it started raining out me i can hardly get my fingers to work man it's raining all over me here man we're gonna put a bid together also to kill all this algae see all that dirt right there so about done with my measurements. We're gonna include all the buildings, all the sidewalks, and then we're gonna get this last little bit of measurement right here, and then we're gonna get out of here. Guys, as you can see right here, it is pouring on me. It's been hard to get pictures because my fingers and I've had to wipe the, I'm soaking wet. I am drenched, guys, as you can see. But nonetheless, we're about to be done with this. We're gonna include all this because this needs to be washed as well. Um, nothing the soft wash can't take care of. So we're already here doing these um, rails. So we might as well hit this as well. So yeah, we're about done. All right, guys, we finally got done with that high school stadium. Uh, we put a quote for just the uh, blue handrails and there was a lot of that. There was thousands of feet of that and they wanted all knocked off the paint So I got to put a turbo nozzle hit every side all around it Vertically and horizontally, you know, so um, Basically, it's gonna be a lot of work I put together a package for all the buildings to be washed the concrete as well And then a separate quote for just the handrail so the booster club can look at it So I'll let you know what happens with that I'm on my way to quote a children's museum now, and then uh, then a house, and then we'll get the day started. The rain storm came through, it put me back a little bit, but uh, we'll be able to get back on track. Positivity, always pressing forward. Let's go. That quote, we uh, got it typed up and emailed to the coach at the school. They're gonna get it to the booster club, which makes the um, decisions. Uh, I gave them a really good deal if they bundled it, so we'll see what they do about that. For now, we're at the Children's Museum, so we're gonna do a quote on the Children's Museum right here. So we're gonna see what, what they would like done and get this out to them right now. So let's see what we're working with. So we're gonna be quoting this roof to be washed right here. You can see right there. So we're gonna be quoting up here. Look at the, the top, you see that metal right there? Right there. See the, see the dirt right there? We're gonna be getting that. And we're gonna be going around and looking and seeing what else we need to wash. This side doesn't need, doesn't need anything at all. They don't want any of the sides washed, um, which it doesn't need it anyhow. So look, it, it looks really, really cool. Really cool children's museum. Doesn't need anything on this side. Looking in the back. We're gonna go back here and see what we need to do back here. I wash all of this block for them. And like I said, right there where the fish is, we'll wash around the fish right there.
We'll hit in here as well. guys we're on our way to a house quote that was submitted via the website and jobber on my link on my website so we're gonna go give them a quote and uh see what's in store see you there all right guys we're at the destination this doesn't look like anybody's living here they may be moving in moving out or, or i don't know if this is a rental but nonetheless see behind me look does it look like uh there was two garbage cans blocking the road i know the garbage man ran today but this is the house and this is a shop and uh so yeah we're gonna give a we're gonna give a bid on this real quick i'm gonna see i'm gonna look at the quote they were, were requesting the service they're requesting and see what all they needed i thought i seen roof wash on there but looks like the siding is in pretty good shape so we're gonna walk around this and uh see yeah, it doesn't look like there's, okay, I see some algae now, right in that top corner there. Okay. Right there on top is gonna be needing wash. So the roof and the siding and possibly the porch. Let's knock on the door and see if somebody comes. Always step back far enough so you don't want to startle nobody. So it looks like they're doing work here, but yeah, the roof needs to be washed. I don't think anybody's here, but I just want to let them know that I'm here. Like I said, this was submitted online. I haven't spoken with anybody. I've called a couple times, but couldn't get anybody. But yeah, it looks like there's just a, just the siding don't look that bad at all. So we'll uh, we'll submit a quote for what they want and uh, get on out of here. Okay, the quote said they wanted a house wash, roof wash, and driveway. Uh, this is a big driveway I can show you right here. Look, this driveway, it's a its a U-turn right here. It goes all the way out. So yeah, and it goes all the way around in here. So this is a lot of, a lot of concrete. So yeah, we'll get this uh, submitted to them. All right, guys, we submitted a quote for the house, the roof, the roof, the shop, all this concrete, the porch steps, everything. That is a lot of concrete, guys. It's a lot of concrete. So we just submitted that. We emailed it back. And we'll wait for a response and move forward. Let me show you. They wanted this done, it looked like, tomorrow or the 11th in the morning time. But see right here? A lot of algae up there, guys. This is the north-facing side, of course. But, yeah. We're gonna get it looking good for them once they approve the quote and send it back. Get it on the books. Let's get to the next one. All right, guys. Um, instead of going to the last and final quote of the day, I went ahead and just, um, it's a single wide trailer. It's three years old. So I went ahead and just booked it, you know, without seeing it. So I uh, talked to the lady. It's, it's already booked, it's done. Uh, everything's good to go with that. Now, I was going to do some house washing, so I have this trailer behind me. I'm taking this trailer to the house. I'm dropping it, and I'm picking up the Honda GX, the OG. I'm picking up the OG. I think I'm just going to call that trailer the OG. I'm picking up the OG. It's the Honda GX 690 with a general pump, hot water unit, Largo unit. And um, it is, uh, it's is—it's got 1,300 hours on it. It's, 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 it's still running good. It's got it maintained and tuned up and it runs like a boss everything works fabulous matter of fact i'm gonna go i'm gonna put that new inline um inline soap um sucker i don't know what the name of it's it's like a um downstream injector but it's not so i'm gonna put that where my downstream injection is and it's supposed to pull the equivalent of an x-jet so we'll see and uh, I'll, i'm gonna go and hook that up and uh 
go home and shower, hang out with the, the, the family a little bit and head out. I got a long night, a lot of gas stations to do. I've got like, I think five or seven gas stations on my list. So we got a really busy schedule. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys when I get back out, all right? Let's go. All right, guys, we are at the first gas station we're gonna do tonight. Um, I haven't started sweating as bad yet, so I'm sure this will be soaking wet by the time we're done. But hopefully we'll get some relief soon, man. Here in the south, you guys, if you're not down here, you don't know. But if you're down here, you know. It is like a 100 degree heat index in the middle of the night. So it's like uh, 1030 right now. And it's like probably 100 heat index, man. It was burning up last night. And I think it's going to end Sunday, get a little better. I hope so. But uh, I got my water hooked up, as you can see behind me right here. I got my water hooked up. I got OG. We got the OG out tonight. And uh, we're going to get to cranking. So without further ado, let's get going. I just want to show you guys real quick how hot water, this is hot water, right? With no chemicals. I did this for a demonstration, right? This is just the Windex window wash that tipped out of there. But I want to show you what no chemicals, strictly hot water can do with the right surface cleaner, the right pressure washer, and the right temperature. Now imagine with chemicals. This is without chemicals. So I wanted to show you guys it's serious, hot water is amazing, it does wonders. All right, guys, I just finished. No, I didn't just jump out of a pool. I just got through working, um, working with this like 200 degree, about 150 degrees. I keep it about 150. Hot water, eight gallons a minute, 3,500 PSI, pumping this concrete, cleaning up diesel, fuel, everything, you name it. We out here getting it, trying to make this place, not trying, but making this place look like a million bucks. So yeah, we're done. I'm gonna change my shirt. I got sweat just falling off me. I'm gonna change my shirt and uh, put another shirt on and get to the next one, because that's what we do. We don't quit, we push forward. So any of you guys out there that wanna get it, just push, never give up on your dreams. Never give up, Let no, the only one that can stand in front of you is yourself. I say it over and over. Find what you really like and you really are good at. If you can find what you really like and it makes money, that's not even a job. It's like a dream come true. But find what you're good at and hone it. 
hone your craft and be the best at it. I'll see you at the next gas station. Let's go. All right, guys. Fresh tea check. No sweat check. It's 12.34 a.m. We are at the next gas station and uh, we're fixing to light it up. We got a full tank of water back there. There's only six pumps, actually three pumps, one on each side, so six actual pumps at this store. Um, so we shouldn't be here that long. We're gonna be hitting the forecourt, the islands, and basically all around the pumps, base of the pumps, and uh, getting the fuel up. So uh, yeah, getting it looking good, and uh, let's go. All right, guys, I'm finally finished. As you can see, I've already put another shirt on. This is long sleeve. I have to look at my truck and see if I can find some short sleeves. I know I got them, but nonetheless, I'm burning up. Um, I got done here. Um, I don't even know what time it is. I don't have my watch on me. I went home and showered and left my my everything, everything at the house. But uh, nonetheless, uh, I got these uh, six pumps done. Let me show you behind me. They look amazing. Look, see, look at that. Got that done. Walk over here, I'll show you what else I got done. Let's see. Look how good that is right there, see? This used to be black. When it dries, it's gonna look like that. This was black, this was diesel everywhere. We moved the garbage cans to get underneath them. Just to give you a little example, see the line right there? But look, look how dark it is compared to here. We don't play, man. We don't play no games, man. We don't play no games, look at that. We don't play no games. It's off to the next one, man. Let's go. Hone your craft. Push, 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 push. Let's go. All right, guys, it's 3.02 in the morning, and I'm at it. So look right here. Look at this dirty gas station right here. It is filthy, man. It's plum filthy. But you know what? I ain't worried about it, because you know what? I got it. I got it under control. So, uh... We're gonna um, we're gonna get cranking on this. We got to get busy before the breakfast run, and hopefully get home and get some rest. Guys, I can't say enough about how good this hot water and sodium hydroxide beads get this parking lot. I mean, it just looks amazing. It looks amazing, man. It looks like a brand new lot. 
Can't brag enough about it, man. officially 4.32 a.m. I'm about an hour from the house. Um, so yeah, uh, we got it looking good. We got the sodium hydroxide down, the hot water. Looks really good all around the garbage cans, all up to the diesel. Got it looking really, really, really good. So yeah, we're gonna head to the house and uh, call it a day. Once this dries right here, it'll look really good. See, just a dark shade of concrete, but it's clean nonetheless. Yeah. All right. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap it up. Just finished. It's hot, it's hot, 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 hot. Soaking wet, soaking wet. Drinking water, water, water. I need to get some Gatorade today. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna get to the house. First, I'm gonna change all these clothes, put some dry clothes on. I got a big ball of wet clothes going and going all day. Starting to fill up behind me. People starting to get ready to go to work. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna get to the house. I'm gonna get this video loaded. And I'll see you guys it's Friday now, so you guys have a great weekend. And uh, if I don't drop a, a video today, I'll drop one first thing Monday. But uh, you guys have a, a, a great night, great morning, great weekend. If you're new, make sure you subscribe if you like this stuff. Well, like I said, we're growing over here, and I appreciate each and one of you guys. Hit the like button, it really helps out. Have a blessed night, and uh, we out of here. Let's go. That's when I first got started years ago. Before I started this, I used to work with them right there, laying brick and block. Right there. That exact truck I rode it many times, him and his brother. Crazy. They pull up right here, about to go lay some brick and block. I'm about to head home. Just got through talking to him, but it's crazy. Eight years ago, I went from that truck, and now I'm in this truck doing this. And uh, yeah, God is good, man. God is good. I got dried off a little bit. It's uh, 5 o'clock, 5 or 6 in the morning. We're going through Hardy's, gotta pay her. She gets paid in um, biscuits, so we're getting her sausage and biscuit today. I'm getting me a low carb bowl. Your boy try to lose some weight, get back in shape. I've been, it's been years, but I'm trying to do that. And uh, she ain't worried about the diet though, but I am. So uh, yeah, we're going to breakfast and uh, head to the house. That being said, thanks for all the new viewers and watchers and support. Man, I appreciate every one of you guys. You guys are awesome, you rock. And. Uh, and I'll see you on the next video, and uh, be safe. God bless you all. We out. All right, guys. I know I said I'm going home, and it's 7 o'clock, and I ain't made it yet. An hour to go. We stopped and got some breakfast, got some coffee, um, met up with some people. We had to take care of some business, uh, drop some checks off at the bank, things we... I knew I wasn't going to get back up. Once I hit the bed, I'm out, so I had to take care of my errands this morning, you know, while I'm up here where I'm at. And uh, nonetheless, we are definitely going home now. We're going to put our head on a pillow and going to sleep. And I'll be woke up probably sometime this afternoon. But uh, anyway, guys, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And we appreciate each and every one of you guys. And for real, for real, we'll see you next time. Let's go.